I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Hi everybody, welcome back or welcome if you are new to my channel. My name is Asia and today is Vlogmas Day 9. I will be showing you guys how I edit my videos, how I make my thumbnails, and yeah, everything in between. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Stay tuned to see all of the things and tricks that I do and let's get into it. So first I'm just going to open up iMovie and airdrop my videos from my phone to my computer. Um, so I'm just doing that right now. And then I'm pulling them over to iMovie. You know, basic stuff. I'm sure you guys know how to do this. Um, I like to add my ending on and my intro. I'm about to go grab my intro because I actually made it in my last video. So I'm going to copy and paste my intro. You know, I'm going to copy it from here and paste it in my next one. Anytime I'm editing videos, I always make my sound go on auto. But right here, I am just looking up some Christmas music. Copyright free, guys. Make sure your stuff is copyright free. Look, look, look hard. Like, if you see, I go down to the description box. I read the description box. I read the comments. I like to see if anyone else has used this song in their videos to see if it's copyrighted or not. I literally one time saw everybody saying, like, one time, this is not copyright. Don't do it. I got strikes. So be careful, guys. Read the comments. Know if it's copyright free or not. And yeah, so basically to download from YouTube to MP3, I just go to YTMP3. That's all you got to type in. Um, or you can type in YouTube converter. It doesn't really matter. YouTube to MP3. You're going to get something like this where you copy and paste your link and then you press download. And then it'll download straight onto your iTunes. Very simple and easy. So I'm just doing that over and over, trying to get some good little Christmas music. Okay, so I want to add my TikTok and my Instagram inside of my video. So what I'm going to do is go to Google, and I'm going to type in Instagram logo or TikTok logo. You're going to type in PNG to make it come out as clear as possible, and then you're going to type in transparent. Sometimes if you type in transparent, the background won't actually be transparent and you'll have to do it on your own. So here's how you do it on your own. You can either go to this website called Background Remove or Background Remover. It's, it's really, really simple. All you do is download your picture on there and then the background, will they'll take it away for you. But this is how you do it on your Mac. You would double click the picture that's on your desktop then you click the little edit button and then you click the remove background button i'm not sure what it's called click any corner and then you drag your mouse inside inwards towards the um, item and yes it should remove your background so i'm gonna show you how you can put text anywhere on your screen in imovie imovie has the titles already pre the, basically you can't move the titles so i'm just gonna show you a way where you can put words anywhere on your screen so the same picture you could take the same picture um just delete the whole picture just cut it out and then you can type anything and you have a transparent background already so you're all good anytime i pop up words on the screen i like to put a little sound with it so that's what i'm doing i'm just adding this little bottle cork noise and that's that little thing uh, yeah you know <laughs> so to be able to move your word or pictures anywhere you just press those two little boxes then picture in picture and then you can just customize it to where you want it to be okay so i like to zoom in so i can be precise and um yeah i'm gonna show you guys how i did what i did in the beginning of the video and you're just gonna click on ken burns um when you go to like cropping out your video and that is the thing that is gonna move it close or far you know what i mean in and out so you're just going to play with that a lot 
And what I like to do is set where I like my beginning to be and where I like my end to be and then cut it up in the middle and fix it. I'm just gonna show you guys. See how I am selecting where I want the image to be at before I split it? That's the best thing you can do to get it as clean as possible because if you're just gonna try, it's, it's hard to measure it. So go ahead and put the place it where you want it to be before you cut your video up because if you cut your video up first you're going to have to place them one by one and it's very it, it's difficult. If you try it you'll see what I mean. And also you want to make sure that you're pressing that little button that I'm zooming in right now. Make sure you press that button every other time so it can go start to end, end to start, start to end, end to start. So here is the remove background thing that I use. And yeah, like I said, it's very easy. You just insert an image and then you download it. And then yeah. So I ended up saving my image and then I make my thumbnails on Canva. So I go there and insert all of the pictures that I'm going to use. So the iMovie uh, logo that you guys saw me get, I'm going to be using that. I'm going to go take a screenshot of my iMovie screen. And yeah, I'm going to just think of a thumbnail and do it. <laughs> It's Vlogmas, so I'm gonna add Christmas colors and I'm gonna title it. Um, I use, I don't know, I, I'm i trying to find my aesthetic. So I'm like, I use different fonts and different things, but different backgrounds all the time and I really need to just get one style and stick with it. But it's kind of hard, so I'm trying to work on that. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that helped you. If you have any questions, you can go ahead and leave them down in the comments below or you can hit me up on Instagram. I'm always active on there. I will get back to you. Um, so yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and learned something new or found something new that you can do with your videos. And yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Vlogmas Day 10.